Hey, 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 what's good everybody? It's your boy Crips here. We're back with another video and in today's video we're going to be making a very, very quick video today showing how you guys can get easy six star chips for your characters in My Hero Academia, the strongest hero. So let's get right into the video. My friend. So I'm pretty sure most of you guys have already seen this exploit or something like that, I guess. Not really an exploit to be honest. It's, you know, it's been around in a lot of gacha games, sort of this kind of strategy, but I'm pretty sure most of you guys seen it, but I'm gonna just show it, you know, make a video about it because I know some people might not, especially some new players as well, right? So I'm gonna show you guys how you can get six star chips very easily. Now, obviously chip farming, it costs a lot, let's be honest, it definitely costs a lot. And, you know, stamina is really hard to come by, especially when you do 25 and, you know, completing the pity, the pity system to getting, you know, a chip that you want is very difficult. And even the hardest difficulty drops, you know, these purple four star chips, which honestly is kind of useless, you know, towards the end game, you know, right? So you don't really want to farm four star. You want to start grinding six stars if possible, right? So obviously is a lot of BP. It costs, I think, I think it's 31 BP if I'm not mistaken, 31,000. And, you know, it is a little bit difficult if you don't have the characters for it, but I definitely ran this with Uraka and Bakugo before and they only have like 21 and 20k BP so it is possible but usually I obviously run all might the thing is you might run out of time might be damaging like I said do not auto farm it if it's difficult for you do it yourself so that you can deal as much damage as possible but I'm gonna show you guys how you can use get the six star chips easily without spending all that stamina so let's get right into that part so it's very simple all you gotta do is deploy obviously right and because I have all might, it's a, lot, a little bit more easier for me, right? I've been doing this since like a long time, right? And I usually auto farm. Like I said, I think I showed a video, you know, of my all might doing this stage, right? You want to do the hardest stage as possible because you want to get six star chips, right? You don't really want to farm, use all your stamina, farm four, five star chips, and then eventually you're going to get six star chips, right? So no point of, you know, doing anything below unless it's not possible for you, right? I don't really recommend farming, farming chips until you can actually do the last stage, in my opinion, right? Just focus on the other stuff first, like leveling up your characters, all that sort. And, you know, then you can try to work your way up and try to do the last stage of the night ops, right? It's fairly easy, I would say. It's just that you're gonna, you might run out of time, as you can see, you only get a minute, right? You might run out of time if your characters are not doing enough damage, right? And then you start to fail, right? But I'm gonna show you guys how you can easily, easily get it. So, as you can see, I'm about to kill it. And right here, you see it's purple, right? So what I do is I close my app and I restart it again. As you guys see, it's a little bit weird because it's full screen and all that sort. But for your mobile devices and stuff like that, that's what you're just gonna, you know, swipe up and you're gonna just clear, right? That's literally all you're gonna do. So it's very simple and very easy. That's all you gotta really do. So yeah, pretty simple. It's not that hard. If you see purple, obviously close your app if you're using mobile devices for blue stacks you can just close the app uh, you kind of, i think you might have saw it when i did it you just, it's on the top part of your bar on blue stacks and then you just click on recent apps and you just clear all and basically that's all you gotta do so very simple so if you guys don't want to you know use all your stamina right and you see purple right because obviously four star chips are kind of useless during this end part of the game you know high level ish right so no point of farming for four stars so you know if you see the gold aura orange aura i'll probably put a screenshot of it in the video right now i, I don't really know the difference between the six star and five star I i'm be honest if you guys know the difference let me know but they to me they look both the same honestly like it both looks orange and i don't know if it's a five star or six star so if it's orange for me then i'm just gonna go with it that's what i usually do so there's that as well anyways hopefully this short video helped you guys out farm these chips i hope you guys are farming chips now because you know aizawa's kind of gone so you know, focusing on leveling up your character first and then after you've leveled up your characters, it's time to farm your support cards and your chips so that you can gain more BP for your characters. Appreciate the support so far. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. Really would appreciate that. Detroit smash that like button down below if you guys enjoyed this video. Really would appreciate that as well. Y'all know the drill. Hit that bell notification. Notifies you when I put up a video. That's going to be for me. Peace.